A family has settled a wrongful death lawsuit against the owners of the Palisades Mall. But as Blaze Gomez reports tonight, they still have serious concerns about the underground parking lot where their family member fell and died a week later. This is what it looks like in the underground parking lot of the Palisades Mall when we walked around on Friday. Right here and they just painted over it. We saw raised or sunken pavement around mostly all the concrete pillars. Some areas are so uneven that entire sections are closed off. That area is really dark and I could see how people fall. Jonathan Masong Song's father, Edwin, did fall here in 2018. His lawsuit against the mall's owners settled this month for $1.6 million after Masong Song's 66-year-old dad broke his hip and died from complications a week later. The suit alleges grossly negligent and reckless conditions that violate common sense safety rules. Right Even here, if you're looking, you're not seeing. Pretty big lip. The family's attorney Michael Feldman says other people have fallen here before and hurt themselves too. The mall has not been a good neighbor. They knew that there was a dangerous condition underground in their parking lot. We reached out to Pyramid Management for comment but didn't hear back. This mall should close that parking lot. It's as simple as that. It's not safe. We have a call out to the Clarkstown Building Department about the conditions and the concerns. In Rockland County, Blaze Gomez, News 12. News 12 learned in February that the Palisades Mall is facing foreclosure after their lender announced that the owners had defaulted on their $419 million loan.